guys welcome back to more mass effect and uh yeah we're carrying on from where we left off we don't know if i should be exploring or not see the mini map doesn't look very good we really explain a lot i would have thought it would show me some terrain but nothing anyway carrying on from where we left off and you don't know which way to go Commander, I'm glad to see you're okay. Losing Jenkins was hard on the crew, and I'm glad we didn't lose you, too. Yeah, I wish I could have done something to save him. I was there. You did everything right. It was just bad luck. It's been a hell of a shakedown, Cruz. Our first mission ends with one Spectre killing another. The Citadel Council's not going to be happy about that probably use it to lever more concessions out of the Alliance. There's something big coming. I don't want anyone messing it up. You read me, Lieutenant? Five by five, ma'am. Is there anything else before we head ashore? We're headed for the Citadel. When we get done with business, you and I should work out a Liberty rotation. Some of the crew could use it, Commander. And that guy's an ass kiss. Where are we going? Like, there's no marker on the map. Have a look at the actual map. Speak to Joker. Be near the front, I guess. I want to speak to these fools. Uh, we'll talk to her. Chakwas. Yes, Commander? Is there something you need? How did you end up serving on an Alliance ship? I enlisted right out of med school. Earth always seemed boring to me. Too safe. Too secure. I figured the colonies were teeming with exotic adventure. I wanted to travel the stars, tending the wounds of tough soldiers with piercing eyes and sensitive souls. <laughs> Turns out military life isn't quite as romantic as I'd imagined. But humanity needs the Alliance if we want to keep expanding through the Traverse, and the Alliance always needs good doctors. So I stayed on to do my part. I don't really care. I should go. Goodbye, Commander. I know there's, um... The stuff that you can talk about with with a lot of these characters just starting off i kind of want to get through this really this isn't a way to uh ship's hull can't sprint any faster we just come in his go chambers. speak to joker when you're ready tell him to bring the normandy into dock I'm trying to figure out how to get to the damn guy. I'm gonna go this way. Maybe it's upstairs. We're going down. Damn it! Did see stairs in the uh, in the previous level? Went up. Oh, we have one of those things. Probably should have read that dialogue. <laughs> Damn door. Good timing, Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. See that taxpayer money at work.
size of that ship? The Ascension, flagship of the Citadel fleet. Well, size isn't everything. Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying you need firepower, too. Look at that monster. Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing it's on our side, then. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy, requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower. Normandy out. Normandy, this is Alliance Tower. Please proceed to dock 422. This is an outrage! The Council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony? The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Seren? You can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action! You don't get to make demands of the Council, Ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Seren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. Just the ground team from Eden Prime, in case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate? They are. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. Oh, everything's bad against him. I'm not gonna sit on my ass just because the Council doesn't want to do anything. If they won't stop Saren, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That's Saren's fault, not hers. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. And that's why I hate politicians. Put on locations are marked on your map. Open the mission computer with options tag. So we've already done the prologue, right? We've already done that, so we need to go to the tower. Where is this damn tower? We're over here. We need to go. Yeah. Point of interest. Can't zoom out enough. We got a couple points of interest. Um, I have no idea how I'm gonna get up to the, the actual main mission. Oh, follow the posting arrow. I wonder if the uh, the doors are like that because it needs to load. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow me to be your guide. Greetings and welcome to the Presidium. My name is Avina, and I am pleased to be your virtual guide throughout this level of the Citadel Space Station. What does that mean? 
I am a fully interactive virtual intelligence programmed to provide spontaneous guidance at predetermined locations of interest throughout this level of the Citadel. I may also be contacted through any of the Presidium VI terminals, should you require assistance. Give me the tour. You are standing at Presidium Tourism Terminal 1. On either side of this lobby are the embassies of the various Citadel races, along with CSEC headquarters. On the far end of this level, you can see the Citadel Tower, where the Council meets regularly to discuss matters of interstellar importance. What can you tell me about the Citadel Council? Originally, the Council consisted of representatives from the Asari and Salarians, the two dominant species in Citadel space. Roughly 1,304 galactic standard years ago, Turians were invited to join the Council in recognition of the role they played during the Krogan Rebellion. Since then, the three Council races have worked together to ensure the peaceful coexistence of the galactic community, while preserving individual autonomy for each species. It can't be as simple as that. There must be problems somewhere in the system. I am not programmed to make that kind of qualified judgment. My code is limited to information and simple interaction simulations. All right, that's enough. Goodbye. Goodbye, and thank you for using Avena. That unlocks XP, though. To the Citadel. Welcome to Presidium Tourism Terminal. On the far end of this level, you can see the Citadel Tower, where the Council... I want to know more about Citadel, Citadel. Secure. Executor Palin, a Turian, is the current head of CSEC. But individuals from virtually every species across Citadel space serve as officers beneath him. If you wish to learn more, Executor Palin's office is located in the CSEC headquarters just across the lobby. We get XP for Goodbye. that. Goodbye, and thank you for using Avena. Okay, I guess we get XP for the one time we actually use it. Not a loading. I guess it was on earlier systems. Saren's hiding something. Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council. Don't be ridiculous. Your investigation is over, Garrus. Commander Shepard, Garrus Vicarian. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. Alright, sorry about the pause there. My subwoofer keeps, uh, clicking on and off. I miss some of the Come across anything I should know about? Saren's a Spectre. Most of his activities are classified. I couldn't find anything solid. But I know he's up to something. Like you humans say, I feel it in my gut. I think the Council's ready for us, Commander. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen to you. You don't want to keep the Council waiting. Which way are we going? Like, there's an arrow on the map, but I think that's pointing north. Well, let me target an innocent person. <laughs> okay, I didn't mean to pull the gun out anyway. Um, what was that thing? Oh, can't do anything with them. The hearing's already started. Come on. The Geth attack is a matter of some concern, but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way. 
The investigation by Citadel security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow Spectre, and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson, you always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. The one who let the beacon get destroyed. The mission to Eden Prime was top secret. The only way you could know about the beacon was if you were there. With Nihilus gone, his files passed on to me. I read the Eden Prime report. I was unimpressed. But what can you expect from a human? Saren despises humanity. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. He has no right to say that! That's not his decision! Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. The humans are wasting your time, Counselor. And mine. Saren's hiding behind his position as a Spectre. You need to open your eyes. What we need is evidence. So far, we've seen nothing. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the Beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? I agree. Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. The Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. This meeting is adjourned. It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. Tell me about this history between you and Saren. I worked with him on a mission a long time ago. Things went bad. Real bad. We shouldn't talk about this here. But I know what he's like, and he has to be stopped. What's our next step? As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the Executor. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that loser. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. I'll take care of it. I need to take care of some business. Captain, meet me in my office later. Harkin's probably getting drunk at Cora's Den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. I thought you said he was a drunken loser. Couldn't hurt to go talk to him. Just be careful. I wouldn't call him reliable. I should go. Good luck, Shepard. I'll be over in the Ambassador's office if you need anything else. All right. Now which way do we go? Like, yeah, the mini maps. We'll uh, 
Too vague. <laughs> um. Okay, well, there's nothing over here, so I guess we've got to... know which way we're facing, to tell you the truth. Are we? Promising. That guy's up to What? Poor woman. No, I wasn't. Never mind. Um, yes, is there something you want? Why are you so interested in the keepers? Keepers? I've got no interest in the keep. Don't get coy. I know what I saw. I, uh... I'm not so sure I should be talking to you about this. We're just talking. Is there something wrong with that? No. I guess it wouldn't hurt to tell you. I'm using a small scanner to gather readings on the Keepers. So far I've had mixed results. I find it difficult to get near the creatures. Why were you being so secretive about it, though? Well, technically we're not supposed to disturb the Keepers. I don't really think my scanning disturbs them, but the authorities might disagree. I'd like to do it more openly, but it's not really worth getting arrested over. I can help you out. I'm not worried about the authorities. I don't even know who you are. I'm Commander Shepard with the Alliance military. Hmm. Well, I, I suppose I could use the help. You'll need this. It's the scanning device I developed. Activated each time you see a keeper. All collected data will automatically upload to my database. I'll even send a few credits your way for each unique scan. I should get going then. Yes, I have much work myself. So long, and good luck with the scanning. Alright, there was one right here. There was one up here. Not gonna go out of my way to look for any others, but if we see them... Scan them. whole area is like you can only go on the the actual path might as well go that way it uh, gets us XP and stuff I don't know what's going on with my sub even I've turned it off. Still clicking on and off. I can I can hear it click. Maybe it's on its last legs. Who knows? Wonder if it's just the amp though. Anyway, just thinking out loud. Never know who you come across on the internet. Someone might have an idea. How many of these things there are around here, but... Not gonna go looking for them, I... Carry on down this way. Yeah, I already actually, I had a, another 12 inch sub before that the amp failed on and uh, ended up buying a new amp and swapping it out. When you remove an amp from a sub, what's left? Just the speaker right in the box. Welcome to Presidium Tourism Terminal 2. Behind to your left, you may see the keepers are essential to the smooth operation of the Citadel. Obstructing their daily work will result in harsh penalties 
including incarceration and rehabilitation. Tell me more about the Relay Monument. Discovered by the Asari who first arrived at the Citadel, the Relay Monument is one of the station's most interesting and controversial features. What is the meaning behind this striking piece of art? Is it a tribute to Prothean vanity? A reminder? That's too much talking. No one can say for sure. Making the Relay Monument a yeah, yeah, That's yeah. all for now. Thank you for using I think I have to talk to them at least once. So that, um... I get the XP. I think this is the only one that I have left to talk to, but I can put a marker there. And all these damn keepers. And this Garrus. Um, journal. Lower wards. That's where we're heading. Right. Oh, we're on the wrong side. I mean, the uh, the ship is actually really impressive. have to be this big this thing do you desire to learn of the enkindlers or has the honorable csec officer enlisted assistance what's going on here the csec officer requests that this one purchase an evangelical permit to spread the truth of the enkindlers let me talk to the csec officer Perhaps I can explain the situation. This one would be most grateful for th that Hanar refuses to listen to reason. Why can't it act in an orderly and lawful manner? Are there laws being broken here? I am not unreasonable. The Hanar is free to spew its nonsense once it purchases an evangelical permit. So if the Hanar gets a permit, it's allowed to preach? No. Registered evangelicals must follow regulations. There are specific areas where preaching is legal. Failure to follow the regulations results in the forfeiture of the license. If you'd like, I could talk to the Hanar for you. I have argued with the stubborn jelly all afternoon. You Has the CSEC officer been assuaged? Is this really how you want to represent the Enkindlers? The truth of the Enkindlers must be made known. They gave the Hanar language and gave the universe the mass relays. This one only wishes to spread the truth to any who will listen. There is no intent to cause trouble. What if I purchase the evangelical permit for you? Finances are only a partial limitation. This one does not believe that one should pay in order to speak the truth. However, this one also does not possess the 150 credits necessary to purchase the permit. And well, another money grabber, but... 150 credits. This should cover you. This is a most appreciated action. You are not of the Hanar, but you wish to help spread the truth of the Enkindlers. 
This one will not cause any further trouble for the CSEC officer. This one offers its thanks. I see the Hanar is left. Thank you. Happy to help. Here, for your assistance in this matter. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should report to my superiors. What do we get? There now. One. Ah, human. This one is greatly pleased to see you here in my decadent emporium. Who are you? This one's face name is Delaninder, though many in this place simply refer to it as Delan. Please take time to examine the fine goods it has for purchase, all of great worth. Have a look Show what they me got. Your items. First shot that I've seen. Oh, this one is pleased to do so, human. You will not be disappointed. I have no idea what that is. Mark this junk. I think I actually marked a lot of my stuff as junk, so. Right, at least I know how to use it now, though. That dude. Welcome to Presidium Tourism Terminal 3. Here in the financial district, a number of businesses offer various goods and services to their exclusive clientele. The statue you see before you was commissioned to honor the Krogan soldiers who gave their lives to protect Citadel space during the Rachni Wars. In the aftermath of the Krogan rebellions, several embassies petitioned to have the statue removed. However, this motion was eventually quashed by the council. That's all for now. Thank you for using Avena. Have a pleasant day. But well, we didn't get any uh, XP for that. Welcome to pre this in the aftermath of the Krogan rebellions, several embassies Tell me more about the Krogan rebellions. In recognition of their efforts during the Rachni Wars, the Krogan were granted several new colony worlds by the Council. Over the next 400 years, the Krogan species began to expand. Blessed with an extremely high birth rate, faced with a critical overpopulation crisis, the Krogan started a violent colonization of nearby worlds inhabited by other Council species. The Krogan rebellions had... For a full century, the Council and its member species fought to bring the Krogan under control. With the aid of the newly discovered Turian Empire, they were ultimately successful. You needed the Krogan to stop the Rachni, then you needed the Turians to stop the Krogan. So who's going to stop the Turians? I am sorry, but that question is beyond <laughs> my programming parameters. The Turians are members of... That's all for now. Thank you for using a VPN. Alright, now it Have gave a us uh, a codex entry and okay, there's one of those crab things over here. We'll go scan this and then figure out how we can get across. So that's gonna send us up. Doesn't look like anything over here, but we'll just take a look. That's way down over there, alright. The mini map doesn't really tell me where I need to go. Damn it. And. That guy in the lounge? We'll have a look over there. I 
think this is where we started off, somewhere around here. Let's see what she has to talk about. Welcome to Presidium Tours. On the far end of this level, you can see the Citadel Tower, yeah, where the council meets her. regularly to discuss Goodbye. Matters. Goodbye, and thank you for using Avena. Please enjoy your visit to the Citadel. Hey, we're, what the hell is this? Big dude. Alright. We're in a diplomatic citadel. I don't think it's up there. Way down. Look like a lounge. This looks like. Don't believe. What do you want? Oh, Commander. Is there something I can do for you? Relax, Private. This isn't an inspection. Right. Sorry. What can I do for you, Commander? What can you tell me about the Asari consort? I, uh... Well, she's an Asari who works here as... That is, she helps people with... things. You never want to see her, did you, Fredericks? I, uh... No, I never did. <sighs> I couldn't afford it. It costs half a year's credits just to go in and talk to her. Can you at least tell me where I can find her? Sure. She's across the bridge from the embassies. Thanks, kid. Have fun. Try not to get into too much trouble. I will. Have fun, that is. I don't have time to talk now. I'm very busy. Hello, Commander. Can I get you something? What have you got? Information, mostly. Would you like to know about some points of interest nearby? Yes. What's going on around here? Well, you found the embassies. Not much going on here. Across the bridge, you'll find the bank, the Emporium, and Shaira's. If you haven't heard of her, you soon will. If you need supplies, you can try the markets one level below. For entertainment, I'd try Flux or Cora's Den. Tell me about Flux and Cora's Den. Well, Flux has gambling and dancing, certainly more lively than this place. Cora's Den, on the other hand, well, let's just say it's livelier and deadlier all at the same time. Goodbye. All right, so we got to figure out how to get down and level. So long, Commander. Have a pleasant day. Somehow. I can't sprint. Damn game. Doesn't have sprint enabled all the time. I will go down. Have a look. What the, the green icon? Door. Oh, there it is. That's what we gotta get to. Just then. That's her. Oh, okay. They dropped anything? Nope, they just disappeared. All right. Back 
off, Rex. Fist told us to take you down if you showed up. What are you waiting for? I'm standing right here. This is Fist's only chance. If he's smart, he'll take it. He's not coming out, Rex. End of story. This story is just beginning. Out of my way, humans. I have no quarrel with you. What was that all about? Who knows? Let's just try not to get caught in the middle. Hey there, sweetheart. You looking for some fun? Cause I gotta say, that soldier get-up looks real good on that body of yours. Why don't you sit your sweet little ass down beside old Hark and have a drink. Let's see where this goes. I'd rather drink a cup of acid after chewing on the razor blade. You trying to hurt my feelings? You gotta do better than that. After 20 years with CSEC, I've been called every name in the book, princess. I'm looking for a CSEC officer, a Turian named Garrus. Garrus? <laughs> you must be one of Captain Anderson's crew. Poor bastard, still trying to bring Saren down, eh? I know where Garrus is, but you gotta tell me something first. Did the captain let you in on his big secret? Just tell me where Garrus is before this gets ugly. But it's all related, don't you see? The captain used to be a specter. Didn't know that, did you? It was all very hush-hush. The first human ever given that honor, and then he blew it. Screwed up his mission so bad they kicked him out. Of course, he blames Saren. Says the Turians set him up. You said they covered all this up. How'd you hear about it? I spent 20 years working cases here on the Citadel. People on this station love to talk. Secrets are like herpes. If you got them, you might as well spread them around. <laughs> Why should I believe a drunk like you? Fine, ask Anderson. I bet he tells you. He's too stupid and proud to lie right to your face. Just tell me where Garrus went. Garrus was sniffing around Dr. Michelle's office. She runs the med clinic on the other side of the wards. Okay. Oh, I heard he was going back there. Med clinic on the other side I'm of the wards. Here. Now we're gonna get to yeah, the wards. Good. Go. Back rooms are private, reserved for Fist and his friends. Goodbye. Enjoy the club. And Garrus? Go away. I'm not interested in talking. Alright, so now we gotta find the wards. So, a minute ago when I came into this area, put out the weapon herself. Oh, we were over here, I want to see. Yeah, which way it was? Was it down here or up top? Top. Hoping to get off this damn friggin' ship. Actually, do some fighting and stuff. Oh. I completely walked past where I needed to go. Idioms, direction, this one. Med clinic, he's sick. We need to go med clinic, he's great. Tech Academy, is that med clinic? Over there, yep. 
All right, kind of figuring out our way around here. I didn't tell anyone, I swear. That was smart, Doc. Now, if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth shut or... Who are you? Let her go. I just ran right in front of me. Look in a second, Garrus. What's that? Can I... Oh, I can shoot that thing. All right. Negative contacts, Commander. Perfect timing, Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. You took him down clean. Sometimes you get lucky. Dr. Michelle, are you hurt? No, I'm okay. Thanks to you. All of you. I know those men threatened you, but if you tell us who they work for, we can protect you. They work for Feast. They wanted to shut me up, keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. What Quarian? A few days ago, a Quarian came by my office. She'd been shot. But she wouldn't tell me who did it. I could tell she was scared, probably on the run. She asked me about the Shadow Broker. She wanted to trade information in exchange for a safe place to hide. Where is she now? I put her in contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Not anymore. Now he works for Saren. And the Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? That's stupid, even for him. Saren must have made him quite the offer. That Quarian must have something Saren wants. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker to get. What else can you tell me about the Quarian? I'm not sure. Like I said, she wanted to trade information for a place to hide. She didn't... Wait a minute. Geth. Her information had something to do with the Geth. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. I'm coming with you. Welcome aboard, Garrus. You know, we aren't the only ones going after Fist. The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex to take him out. Yeah, we saw him in the bar. A Krogan might come in handy. Last I heard, he was at the CSEC Academy. What's he doing there? Fist accused him of making threats. We brought Rex in for a little talk. If you hurry, you can catch him at the Academy before he leaves. Move out. All right, so... So that... Take all the way on the right is one of my favorites. Garrus is my favorite as well, so. They look the same. They look the same. Right. What weapon does he have? He has a pistol. That's cool. Overkill allows long bursts of salt fire without overheating. Right? Your boost recharges a portion of your. Got first aid as well. Pretty good. Nice addition to my tea. My skill.
And now I'm gonna start focusing on the other ones. I mean, I, d I don't know why sniper rifles aren't unlocked yet. We can put a point in sniper. Not yet. Maybe it unlocks at a certain level. One point in there for now. But unlock these. That looks good. Don't want to do that, but the deck is down that way, I think. Hey, I know you. You're Shepard, right? Torfin was a case study during my training. I can't believe you took out the whole base. Amazing. Looks like you have a fan. I'm sorry, I just never thought I'd meet someone like you in person. Uh, my name's Lang, Officer Eddie Lang, Citadel Security. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. What are you doing down here in the wards? Anything I can help you with? Why'd you join Citadel Security? I don't know. Seemed like the right thing to do, you know? Maybe it's in my blood. My grandfather was a cop back on Earth. It's kind of what CSEC is. Police for the Citadel. I'm still pretty new at it, but I like it so far. Way more interesting than staying back on Earth. You get to meet all kinds of cool aliens. Like those Hanar. Wild. Plus, CSEC gets a lot of respect here. We uphold the law. People, even aliens, appreciate that. I have to go. Right. You're probably real busy. Well, see you around, Commander. Is that the extra net terminal? All right, we'll go this way. In light of the recent attack on Eden Prime, many colonial investors are pulling their support for future projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization in... Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. Go on. Get out of here. Do I know you, human? My name's Shepard. I'm going after Fist. Thought you might want to come along. <sighs> Shepard. Commander Shepard. I've heard a lot about you. We're both warriors, Shepard. Out of respect, I'll give you a fair warning. I'm going to kill Fist. Fist knows you're coming. We'll have a better chance if we all work together. My people have a saying. Seek the enemy of your enemy. And you will find a friend. Glad to have you on the team, Rex. Let's go. I hate to keep Fist waiting. All right, we've got our team. Tough guys. This is my tank, and this is my co sniper. Now where are we going? Now we're going to see... Rex, right? Yep. Down this way. A Solarian excavation team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Hanar protesters have blockaded the... Okay, now we've got a flashing arrow all of a sudden. 
we scan that kind of backtracking a little bit here because we've already found where he is already scanned that one can't scan them again all right that's good to know all right it's saving I forget which way it was this way no it wasn't that way the other way Logo. I did try and come this way before. This where the other uh, guy was. Stop right there! Don't come any closer. Warehouse workers. All the real guards must be dead. Stay back, or we'll shoot. I just killed fifty bodyguards to get in here. What do you think I'll do to you? Uh. Well, uh. Screw Fist. He doesn't pay us enough for this. <laughs> it would have been quicker to just kill them. Shooting people isn't always the answer. Oh my god, I used the Medi Gel. Trying to One figure out. I have to switch my weapon. Yeah, that's my sniper rifle. Couldn't get in cover at the back there. What the hell? That's kind of annoying. I mean, I try to get into cover. Oh, gee. Oh, it spawned us outside. I'll keep this weapon. Nope. Keeps equipping the same weapon. Got another one on her back, but she won't equip that one. Looks like it's shut down. This knows we're coming.
use them to get the flank. Stop right there! Don't come any closer! Warehouse workers? All the real guards must be dead. Stay back, or we'll shoot! I just killed 50 bodyguards to get in. Uh, well, it would have been quicker. Shooting people isn't always. All right, this time I'm not gonna rush in. I swear I thought I was gonna hide behind the, uh... Why do I have to do everything myself? Time to die, little soldiers. Thing the... I surrender. Tell me where the Quarian is, and I won't have to shoot you in the kneecaps. She's not here. I don't know where she is. That's the truth. He's no use to you now. Let me kill him. Wait, wait. I don't know where the Quarian is, but I know where you can find her. The Quarian isn't here. Said she'd only deal with the Shadow Broker himself. Face to face? Impossible. Even I was hired through an agent. Nobody meets the Shadow Broker, ever. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting for her. Give me the location, now. Here on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them right now. You can make it if you hurry. What are you doing? The Shadow Broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. A lot of people died because of him. He had it coming. Now let's move. We have to save that Quarian. Give me the loot. Yeah, the first time it was a little uh, finicky there, because... I honestly thought I was hiding behind this. Didn't know there was turrets on either side. I, I oh crap. Didn't realize there was a timer. it open yes open yes it doesn't open all right did you bring it where's the shadow broker where's fist they'll be here where's the evidence no way the deal's off. I couldn't trust him. Were you hurt in the fight? 
I know how to look after myself. Not that I don't appreciate the help. Who are you? My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life. But not here. We need to go somewhere safe. We could take her to the human embassy. Your ambassador will want to see this anyway. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards, an all-out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many... Who's this? The Quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? This Quarian can help us bring down Saren. I would have told you that if you hadn't jumped down my throat. I apologize, Commander. This whole thing with Saren has me a bit on edge. Maybe we should just start at the beginning, Miss... My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage. My rite of passage into adulthood. I've never heard of this before. It is a tradition among my people. When we reach maturity, we leave the ships of our parents and our people behind. Alone, we search the stars, only returning to the flotilla once we have discovered something of value. In this way, we prove ourselves worthy of adulthood. Tell us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. What did you find out? Most of the core was wiped clean. But I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. He said Eden Prime brought him one step closer to finding the conduit. Any idea what that means? The conduit must have something to do with the beacon. Maybe it's some kind of Prothean technology. Like a weapon. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. I feel like I've heard that name before. According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life, and they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. They won't believe you anyway. Just keep them out of this. We have to tell them. Even if they don't believe anything else, this proves Saren is a traitor. The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her? The Quarian. My name is Tali. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. I'll take all the help I can get. Thanks. You won't regret this. Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the Council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. Oh, great. Um, so I like all three of these, but I may equip the uh, tech stuff, biotic strength, ease, tech strength, let's go with that, that gives us two at least.
Alright, um... Did it tell us where we needed to go next? Oh, you can use Omni Gel to override, alright. Not sure why you would need to. Captain Henderson reported some unusual energy readings during a patrol in the Argos Row Cluster. She had particular concerns about the Hydra system, but was recalled before her team could investigate further. No patrols are scheduled for that sector. Want to send in a recon team. Let's see where we're going with the journal. Like I can't mark this on the map so I don't know where I'm going to deliver it. Reporter might be interested, right? Still scanning, oh my god there's many of them. Alright, we've completed this one. Alright, we'll get there eventually, go to the Hydra system. Where the hell am I going to find a reporter? We're over here on this side. That's just a point of interest. That's just the... Um... Oh, what is it? That's just the... That NPC that talks to you. All right, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna stop right here. Thank you for watching. If you like what you see, please like and subscribe. Um, I will find where I've got to hand this in. We'll continue in the next video with that. Sounds boring. Yep, I'll catch you in the next one. Take it easy.